Welcome to 1311 Regal Crescent Northeast and this brand new semi-detached home in the community of Renfrew. Four bedrooms, three and a half bathrooms. It is a beautiful home. Let's not waste any time, let's have a look. Welcome inside to this brand new semi-detached home in the community of Renfrew. Um, just to give you a little bit of the lay of the land, we do have the Renfrew Community Center right over here, just a couple blocks away. And there are uh, pools inside, there's a fitness center, uh, soccer pitch as well, some other fields nearby, and I see some tennis courts as well. So for recreational opportunities, uh, there is no shortage of that. And of course, typical inner city, we have grocery stores, restaurants, uh, and all those amenities that you would come to expect of a community like this. But as we get inside the home a little deeper, you can see the dining area right here. This is on the north side of the home. And opposite to that is your backyard, which is gonna be on the south end for those uh, sunny days. But we'll talk about that a little bit later. All right, let's come on into this kitchen, check it out. Uh, very functional. And the first thing that I notice is this beautiful quartz countertop. Uh, fantastic veins running through here. Kind of a dual, like a two-tone kitchen, but the the white of the quartz and the backsplash, this subway tile backsplash, really offsets the darker cabinets through here. Uh, and then of course, really bright white uppers. And I love these industrial uh, style lights right up here to light up this kitchen island. Great space over here for four uh, stools, probably maybe even five. Um, and then, you know, you have these Samsung appliances throughout with the very cool fridge. It's got this huge screen off the front and gas range, which is really nice for you chefs out there. And of course the hood fan will support that. Built-in microwave as well. So it's a fully featured kitchen, plenty of storage, pantry space. What else can you ask for? So let's head into the living room now, and it's really an extension of this kitchen area. Very classic, open concept, inner city homes. And one of the first things that I notice is this beautiful, light, engineered, wide plank hardwood flooring. And then right up top, I'm looking at these nine foot ceilings. So very open, lots of space in here, great light. And as we actually move into the living room, speaking of light right behind me, you have the access to the south facing backyard. That's gonna be fantastic for those summer barbecues. And in here, um, certainly plenty of space, very comfortable. You do have this gas fireplace as well. So as we're approaching winter here, that's gonna come in real handy. And I love the floor to ceiling tiles that wraps this fireplace as well. And then right off the back here, of course your back entry, a little bit of a landing, mud room, and uh, some places to hang a coat and a little bit of storage up top. All right, let's head on up to the second floor and check out those bedrooms. So we're on the second level now, and behind me there's two bedrooms, uh, pretty good size actually, and they both have finished closets as well. There's a full bath off to the side here that uh, services these two bedrooms. And just underfoot, this carpet feels amazing actually. Very neutral tone, and it kind of works well with this space. You do have the white walls, but it gives you the opportunity to let your artwork really stand out. So let's head back towards the primary bedroom. First of all, I have this big west-facing window tons of light flooding in and it's great because you have this desk area here if you need to do a little work that's going to give you a little bit more light which is really nice now also we have a laundry room off to the right hand side here and that of course is very convenient you have three bedrooms up here so if you need to do your laundry it's right there as we enter into the primary bedroom uh, one of the first things you're gonna notice is this high ceiling. This vaulted ceiling is fantastic. It really opens up the space. And of course, large windows as well for that daylight, uh, fantastic. King size bed, you have ample room in here. And just in front of me over here, you do have a walk-in closet as well. 
All right, now that we've had a look at the bedroom, let's go check out this bathroom. And uh, one of the cool things that you're gonna notice is this sliding barn door, very handy. And uh, as we come into the space, really nice neutral tone, gray tile on the, on the floor, uh, and then the dual uh, undermount sinks and the white quartz, of course, is gonna carry through into the bathroom. Soaker tub, which is always nice for soaking those weary bones after a cold day. And these really nice upgraded black fixtures, glass entry into the shower, and then that floor to ceiling gray tile is carried through in here. And then nice detailing on the, the floor tile as well. There's a little bench in there for you to just hang out on and uh, soak in that nice hot shower as well. But uh, now that we've seen this bathroom, we also need to go downstairs and have a look at that lower level. Back down on the main floor and we're gonna head downstairs to have a look at that lower level. But of note, we have this really nice half bath over here. Um, some co cool hexagonal flooring pattern uh, and they've carried that into the backsplash as well. Really nice and again, quartz undermount sink and those really nice black fixtures and kind of a funky light in here. I really like the styling of that as well. So let's head on downstairs and take a look. So we've come down to the lower level and one of the things I really noticed is the beautiful railings as well. This kind of honey tone with the uh, wrought iron looks absolutely fantastic. And of course that goes all the way through to the top floor. But behind me, there is the fourth bedroom with a large walk-in closet. And then off to my left, a full bath as well. So let's head on back into the rec room and you're gonna notice quite a bit of width through here, lots of space, those nine foot ceilings as well. And that beautiful carpet works really well down here. And it really opens up as we get in here. I can really see a TV here. That's gonna be your, your Netflix and chill kind of thing. And that's gonna go well with this wet bar. Great for making some cocktails. You've got your wine, uh, sink, and that subway tile. That carries down here from the kitchen as well. I think it looks fantastic. Plenty of light down here. There's a west facing window as well. Uh, and so this is just gonna be a good space for you to hang out and relax. So I think that's it. I hope you enjoyed this tour of this beautiful semi-detached in the community of Renfrew and reach out if we can help you.